could be clothes elsewhere and I threw away so much jewelry, so much crap. Yeah, we're not taught that that stuff is bad. We just think it's cool. Yeah, I just thought it was cool and hippie-ish <laughs> and didn't even think anything about it. And uh, unplug my cable TV and just have little bunny ears, you know, don't really need it. Yeah. That's why I always tell people if, it's if it convicts you, it's probably not. It's like food. If you eat something bad and your stomach don't like it, your stomach, your body's telling you it's not for you. Yeah. And so it's like that in a spiritual way, too. If, if there's something that's annoying you or bothering you yeah. or convicting you, it's not good for you. Yeah. Not good for you. Yeah. We, we complicated. It's not really complicated at all. Yeah, I want to eat like Jesus eats, you know, just dates and nuts and fish and just eggs and eat healthy. Yeah, we're supposed to be 120. I don't know too many people who live to be that long. Just be basic. Yeah. Come, Jesus, come. They ain't trying to make it about rules. It's not rules. He's trying to give us the best life. I'm still confused about the rapture thing. Like, is there a rapture? Does he come? Or do we have, is it the second coming only? Well, the Bible speaks about that. But at the same time, I'll focus more on your work. Because if you don't get the work done, he's put you here for. You're not going with him anyway. We was all created to do a work for him. Like that fig tree. That fig tree is the best example you can get. He cursed it because it wasn't done when he tried to receive some. He's made a de deposit and investment into us, and he wants his return. That's right. When he returns, he wants his re return of his investment. God invested Jesus in us, and so he wants his return. Yeah. 